Hey, welcome back to Red Blue Labs. I'm glad you're here. And on today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to install a very useful script called linpeas.sh. It is a shell script that we use when we're doing capture the flag machines, when we're doing things like hack the box, uh, Vuln Hub machines, we download them. And when we load them onto our target machine, we've gained access. We are able to run this script and it will tell us all the various ways that we can actually escalate our privileges, which is exceptionally helpful. Um, so in this video, I'm going to be showing you where to, where to download it. And then I'm actually going through and using the script to tell me which ways on a target machine I can actually escalate my privileges. All right, let's dive right in. So first things first, we're actually going to go and I've got my Kali machine open and I'm going to open up my browser here. I'm going to go to Firefox and we're going to navigate to the GitHub where we can actually download uh, LinPees. So let's go ahead and do that. So you can see in the URL, that's, that's the location that you're going to want to go to. And you're going to click here and you're going to uh, grab a copy of it. Okay. Uh, you're going to go to your shell and you're going to clone it into your, into your Kali machine or whatever operating system that you are using. Now let's go and watch a recording where I actually uh, compromise a machine and load up this script in there. And then I'm going to also grab all that, that data that I get from the target machine. And then I'm going to bring it back to my attacking machine. All right, let's go take a look at that. So a little side note here, we are going to be watching a previously recorded uh, video that I made of myself uh, compromising a machine and loading up LinPees and grabbing the data and bringing it back. The reason that we're doing a voiceover of a previously recorded session is because I did some editing on the video and it just makes things a little bit smoother for, for watching. So let's go ahead and we're going to start it. So first things first, we're going to do a nmap scan of our target machine. So 1.77 is our target. Now this is a metasploitable machine, which means it's loaded with vulnerabilities, but that's okay because in this video, it's not important what the, the target is. We just want to see LinPees in action. So yeah, there's going to be a lot of stuff that LinPees comes back with. Uh, I chose our login, but metasploitable has got tons of different vulnerabilities that you can exploit. Uh, we gain access to the machine. I open up a new tab and then in here, I log in as a super user and I'm going to switch to the directory that has my linpeas uh, script. So I have it in tools and you can see right there that we've got the linpeas uh, script right there. Now I want to grab the IP address of my attacking machine. So my Kali machine here is 1.77 and remember that the, the target machine is uh, 77. Now, right here, I'm starting a Python web server. And take note that it was actually created in the file, the folder where the linpeas exists. So on our target machine now, I'm going to be using wget. And I'm going to call back to my attacking machine on the port that I set. And I'm going to grab the specific script that lives there. Right here, it, we were able to grab it. And there we go. LinPees now is actually on the system. Great. Uh, did, a, did a few tests. And on Metasploitable, I needed to change the execute, LinPees to be executable, which is fine. Uh, over here, we're going to now run the script. And I'm going to have the output into a file called output. And at this point, I did edit out some stuff because it is LinPees took a little bit of time, maybe two, three minutes to run, uh, but I skipped right to the end for the sake of this video. Now on my attacking machine, I want to open up a listening port and I'm going to redirect all of the, the data that's going to go to that port to a file called myoutput.txt. So it's listening. I've got my Metasploitable uh, machine. I've, I've got access. Now I'm going to connect to that port on my attacking machine and I'm going to be sending it the file that we just created from LinPees. And take note of the direction of the arrow. 
point to the left. And I like to give it a give it a, a few seconds to really make sure that's going through, but I edited the video there. So now if we look at it, we can see that I've got the file right there. Stuff saved stats. Oh no, we got my output.txt. That's the one that I that's the one that I made. Um, and if we go ahead and we do a cat of that file, we can see all of the stuff that Linp's got. So now I'm not going to be going through every single thing in here because the point of this video is just to see Linp's in action. But as you can see right there is that it it does isolate and bring to your attention areas that you could potentially um, gain privilege escalation. We just saw Linp's in action. It's very straightforward. It's easy to grab. Uh, once you've gained access to a target machine, all you have to do is upload it to that machine, um, run it, and then bring the data back to your, your attacking machine. And so it's pretty straightforward. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're enjoying the content, please go ahead and like and subscribe. That would be great. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.